Our feature fight underway at 185 pounds, round number one. Black and white trucks for Dave Mundell, black trucks for David Simpson. Immediately, there's the patience of Dave Mundell on the outside. Got that classic right hand versus left hand. All about who steps outside that foot gets a straight punch, John. Hook to the body, just off the mark for Mundell. Hands high, active for David Simpson. See, Simpson's looking to throw that uppercut if his opponent's head's down in the range. See how he ducks that head down. He's waiting to throw that uppercut in Simpson. Moment ago, the naked left hand from the southpaw stands for Mundell. Then the 3-2 off the hook. 105 remaining round one. Faints again from Dave Mundell. See the diversion on the flick up jab. Jab to the body. Simpson showing patience as well. Lead right hook from the southpaw stands for Mundell. Simpson really not throwing any punches right now. He's just really waiting to count. Problem is, is Mundell's being very elusive and evasive. He's not really committing the punches. He's throwing there was a good commitment. Mundell to the body with that straight left. Entry on the left hand. Into the clinch. Not an active clinch. That's the immediate break from Chris Young. Right back to it. Chris Young, Andrew Glenn, A++ Combat Sports referees. And the bare knuckle, they keep the fights moving. That's a slip, ruled as such by Chris Young. No controversy there. Faint on the left hook from Simpson. That is the end of round one. Love that front foot pressure right there by Rondell. Heavy on that right leg. Round number two underway. Overhand left on the entry for Mundell. How difficult for Simpson's trainer, Jason Williams, watching at home in Wales. Not able to be in the corner, just as he does for Bobo Bannon. Has to be nerve wracking. Double jab from Mundell. Step in left from Mundell. Simpson's got to start letting go with some punches right there. He's going to continue to lose that decision he's talking about if he doesn't land a punch. Jab, but then fully land from Simpson. I said Simpson's not really fully committed to any of those punches right here. I'd like to see that jab followed by the uppercut. I don't care if it lands on the body, head, anything. Throw that right uppercut. Mundell. As he talked about, we're definitely seeing more forward movement from him. Simpson, staying flush in the center circle, now backed off by that left hand. Mundell to the body once more. Get to the body with the left goes Dave Mundell. 35 seconds remaining round two. Dave Mundell has had some good straight left to the body. Like to see him throw a couple more of the left body and then throw that upstairs. Hard entry jab by Mundell into the clinch. Give me an activity and again the break from Chris Young. See there, he tried to throw that left hand upstairs right there. You lull him in with that left hand of the body, then go upstairs. Keep him guessing. Smart from Simpson. He won it out of that clinch, bringing his hands together. Again, left to the body, right hand, left hand right back from David Simpson. Final seconds, round two. The bell next stop, round three. Ball of knuckle up from Chris Young. Again, methodical forward pressure from Dave Mundell. Saw some of that in round number one from Mundell, a lot of that in round number two from Mundell. There he comes right back to it. Mundell to the body, left hand, then the overhand right. Like I said, you throw that left hand the body several times, and that opens up the... The left hand to the, to the face right there because you're looking for that body. 1-1-2 one, one, from Mundell. We're definitely seeing improved defense from David Simpson. What we're not seeing is a lot of offensive output from David Simpson. I will say, Sean, you don't win a fight by not getting hit. You've got to hit the opponent. It's all about damage being done, in my opinion. You've got to do damage. 
into the clinch. Defense is obviously crucial, but in combat sports, it does not win rounds. <laughs> Right hand pulled back by David Simpson. Step in, left hand again for Mundell. Offensive flourish. Double takedown, double slip. Mundell now cut under his right eye. Right back to it. Just before the double slip, it was the most offense we've seen in any single sequence from David Simpson thus far in this fight. Mundell again to the body. Four pressure once more from Dave Mundell. To the body again. Big exhale from David Simpson. Final seconds, round three of our feature fight. Right hand into the clinch. See Mundell bringing his hands together. Now the underhook. The break from Chris Young at the bell. We move to round four. With Combate Global, they decided against it. But Colorado has just approved real-time scoring. They used it in Invicta last week. Or at least some people are wising up. Pioneered by my great and one and only Kansas Athletic Commission. <laughs> Round number four. I mean, still, still the one doing all the work right now is Mondale. And again, to your point, though, we have fun advocating real-time scoring, but... If the fighters literally, not figuratively, but literally know the score, they can adjust the strategy. Very important to be able to know what the score is, in my opinion. Right back to it orders Chris Young. Mundell would think that he's up 30-27. Maybe he is, maybe he isn't. <laughs> well, he's got a good little cut under his eye, but... That opened in round number three. Long, straight jab from Mundell. Simpson looking for the diversion with the right hand, then the up jab. Into the clinch. Short left hand from Mundell. Overhook, grabbed by Simpson. Double overs, and that's the break. Simpson's trying to get into that clinch here, but it's not utilizing it there. Left hand, right hand. Good sequence from Mundell coming forward. You can tell Simpson did not like that at all. On the right hand, another right hand lands from Mundell. To the body. Break again from Chris Young. 20 seconds remaining round four. Overhook this time from David Simpson. Defensive clinches Chris from David Simpson. Yeah, he's not utilizing for any kind of offense. Not able to land many punches. There's, I don't There's know a there's been trying to land. Off the right hand, uppercut, and the left hand. Good sequence from David Simpson. Closing stages, round four, the bell, we move to the fifth and final round. Round number five underway. Go back to what David Simpson said in our fighter meeting. Most likely I'm going to knock out Dave Mundell or he is going to outpoint me. Dave Mundell looks like he's stepping it up this round more than anybody. I mean, he's really coming after it this time. Mundell. Off the double jab after he fainted with the lead right hook. Straight punches, forward into the clinch. Right hand, there's the overhook. And again, the defensive clinch from Simpson. I mean, Simpson did a good job of blitzing, but then he tied up right away. He's got to keep going punches. Simpson in, right back out. The right uppercut didn't fully land from Simpson. Thanks from Mundell. Dell talked about increasing his forward movement. We've seen a lot of that. And flat on his back goes David Simpson. Now peace out. He walked right into that punch. That's exactly what happened. The count of 10 reached. And the win for Dave Mundell. He just keeps on rolling. Got what he wanted right there. Got the big knockout. And here it is right here. You can see... Dave Simpson rushing forward and just got caught with that right hook. Just folded him up. It's always that punch that you don't see, Sean. Right here, he comes forward. Head straight up, got hit with that right hook. Boom, that's all she wrote. Ladies 
ladies and gentlemen, our referee at charge, Chris Young, steps in and calls.